Do you guys think that Roblox has ever known what they were doing or this entire time that they have existed, have they just been guessing each and every teeny tiny little thing, every decision that they have ever made? Are they just guessing? Because at this point, and I mean, I don't know why I say at this point because it's been happening for a very long time, but it has always kind of seemed like they are just guessing. They genuinely have no idea what they are doing. Because five years ago, probably almost six years ago, I made a video called Roblox please stop removing features and that video even in the thumbnail says not a solution and the description of that video said Roblox removed the slash me command I think it was to stop scam bots but that is not a solution so even back then all the way almost six years ago they were removing entire features instead of trying to fix the problems that were happening kind of because of those features and then just a few days ago I made another video about Roblox removing messages and this time they have given us a reason today like I'm gonna get into that in just a second but everyone still seems to think that it's because of the scam bots or the spam messages or quite literally anything even close to that which is basically them removing another feature just because there is a problem with it and instead of fixing that problem and trying to find a permanent or at least a pretty good solution they just remove the entire feature like I said they have given us a reason today which is more than we usually get even if they are kind of lying they have delayed the date that they are removing them from the 7th of October up until the 29th of October so we should have initially seen messages disappear just a few days ago but now they are still here right now we can still send them we can still receive them and that's gonna be happening up until the 29th of October and for this messages update they have entirely changed the wording they now say we are sunsetting user to user communication within in inbox messaging on October 29th, inbox will continue to be used for system messages from Roblox to users. Which like I said is exactly what I tried to explain in my last video about this because they didn't really tell you any of that and people were like oh my god when the 7th of October comes messages is just gonna completely disappear we are never gonna be able to see it again we're never gonna see our old messages that we received or sent or anything like that which was just not true even though I tried to explain that in the video people still panicked about that so hopefully now they will see this and kind of understand that that's not what's going to happen although this is a very hidden messages update for the people that don't really visit this page unless they see videos like this or anything about this on Twitter they are really not going to know that this is happening because the only place they say anything about this is actually on the messages page. But here, take a look at this because Roblox just admitted that they kind of did something wrong. They said last week we announced through a banner that we plan to sunset user to user communication within inbox messaging on October 7th. We acknowledge that we failed to provide context and enough notice and apologize for this. Below, we will share updated timing and explain more. Guys, have we ever, like we need to mark this right now on the calendar as an international holiday. Today will forever be remembered as the day that Roblox first of all acknowledged they did something wrong and second of all apologized for it and then third of all if we scroll down a little bit more they have given us a few different reasons as to why they are doing this. I don't really know why they pick and choose which decisions and which up Updates they decide to explain themselves for because I know that sometimes in the past they have given us reasons just like this and we all celebrate we all jump up and down in a circle holding hands singing dancing just celebrating together about Roblox finally talking to us and finally telling us something but then we will go through another like 10 updates where they don't say a single word and they plan to never say a single word they will continue living as if they never made that decision and then suddenly they will hit us with another thing where they are talking to us and communicating with us. So I don't really know, but let's not complain too much. Here are the top reasons why we are sunsetting user to user communication within inbox messaging. They make it sound like a top 10 YouTube video. Number one is low usage, engagement and quality. Number two, new ways to connect with your community. Number three, safety. 
Number four, streamlining messaging entry points. And those are the entire reasons. I mean, they do give S's with each individual reason for some reason, but we don't need to go through all that. I'm not going to read all of that. It's like that one image that says not reading all that happy for you though, or sorry that happened. Yeah, we just don't need to. I think all you need to know is low usage engagement is probably exactly what they are talking about. People don't really use messages and I completely understand that. Still doesn't mean that should be a reason to remove it though because low usage means that there is still some usage and now all of those messages fans are going to be absolutely distraught. New ways to connect with your community is something to do with the fact that they are changing groups into communities and those communities are going to have their own individual forums. Safety is where they kind of admit the things about spam messages and scams and people not really being safe but also not really. Streamlining messages entry points I don't even know what that one is supposed to mean. We're not going to read into that one. Basically, all we need to know is that they are still removing messages, except now they have worded it a bit differently and they have given us more context. So hopefully people stop being confused about this and stop thinking the wrong thing. But still, when all is said and all is done, they are still removing another feature instead of fixing the problem, which has been a trend for six years. We know at the very least they have been removing features for as long as I can remember instead of fixing the problems. So please, the comments is the place to go. Tell me what you guys think about Roblox removing messages and also apologizing for not giving enough information before. Thank you guys so much much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.